At least I made good money. Up to 15,000, I could probably start building uh, businesses. I still need renown, though. There's a point where all the money in the world won't help you get any further. Well, mostly. Okay, having all the money in the world really does help you get further in pretty much any instance. However, you do need a certain amount of renown to do anything useful aside from build your own kingdom. And even then it helps because it automatically increases your max up an army size. Army? Army size. Oh, yes, I can speed up. Yay! Wee! Uh, they were just blathering away for getting I could uh, speed it up and talk about something more useful. Join the tournament. Place a bet on myself. 500. I hope I win. Perhaps I'm being a little overconfident. But that is all right. I have no problem being a little overconfident. As long as I don't lose my 500 for no reason. I don't know, not a fairly bad investment. I get 13 to 1, so I get paid pretty well. And 500, really, with the amount I can make in trade, is not that huge a concern. Oh, really? would go and do that. But it's alright, since I'm alright. Yay! Now it's a thousand. Is it... Okay, two on two. Now their archers start shooting. Perfect time to kill mine. Little touch. No good. Aha! I dodged. Yeah, most excellent. Alright. I win again. Yay. My investment is starting to look less stupid. Alright. Actually, there's not that much that's... 7 to 1? Okay. I've risked 1,500. I'll be rather disappointed if I don't win this tournament. If I do, it will be most worthy an investment. I guess that's the risk of gambling. Oh, all my guys are dead. Archer, help me! Why did you put your bow down? Crap. Alright, thank you. You were useful, thank you. Hmm. Alright, I'll take it. Of course, having a not bow would be nice. Oops. In the face. In the face again. Can't even block with this, so I have no choice but to be super aggressive. Stop it. Stop it. Damn it. Crap. Oh well, that's 2,000 down. Curse you, mercenary swordsman. What, what's... Do you know any songs about me? No. Okay. Interesting. Well, that's kind of cool. If you get renowned or something, I suppose, you have the chance to have the minstrel sing a song about you. Well, that'd be pretty, pretty neat. Ooh, Lord Effects. Yarl switched to the Serenids. Okay. Salt. Salt and Suno. Look at all that salt. Yum. Now, health note, everyone. While I say yum with salt, it is something that when overindulged, like anything else, can be dangerous for your health. So do not overindulge in salt. Although, conversely, you can't cut it out of your diet completely. 
So just keep those tips in mind and you'll have fewer health problems in the future. Wasn't the right merchant anyways. But that is all right. I have fixed the problem now. There was a tournament in Praven I'm almost afraid to go to. Uh, let's see, what can I do other than tournaments to gain renown? What renown do I have? 41, not that great. Is that cat again? Alright, let's see. Let's just... Let's just go hunting. How much money do I have? Well, the Swedian is losing a lot of territory. It's fairly unfortunate for them, isn't it? Dehirim was conquered by the Serenids. Still got that castle. Ryandi was captured by the Serenids. This castle was captured by the Nords. Uxal was captured by the Nords, and they're attacking Grimblet. Wow, they are really bad off. And, uh, it can't be good. But I will find some mercenaries nonetheless. I suppose if those northern territories are lost too and I join the Swadians, my territory will be somewhere more convenient. We shall see. We shall speed. All right. Oh. Ooh, ee. Just hug the wall here. Are you gonna come closer? No? What kind of bandits are you? Afraid to attack the person you're attacking? City guards will get here if you don't. That would be nice if I could wait them out. Aha! Here's a crappy bandits. And that's what happens when you mess with Madame Filibuster. Alright, well that was money. And I leveled. And the cat is meowing. Let's see, where do I want to go with my love lane next? Uh, let's do more charisma. More leadership, have a bigger army. Increase my one hand weapons. So my max party size now, 97. Excellent. Let's try the tap. No, not take a walk around the streets. Visit the tavern. Mercenary swordsman. They're all right. Seven of them. All right. Excellent. Leaves me room for five more guys. Let's go off to the Hiram. Over there. We see if it's under siege. And the odds are, well, it's no longer under siege. See what the odds are. Come on. Is the tavern? No. Can't follow her. Okay. I'll take it. Let's see where to take these. Leather work. To Yalen. Nothing for iron. Hmm. Swedians are really bad off, aren't they? I totally want to take advantage of it. If I attack them, I could take one of these castles, I guess. Let's see what this castle has here. If I want my own kingdom. It's already under siege, is it? 
Oh, is that the Swedian army there that I just walked past? Let's see. 181. I, I really don't want to do that. Not without upgraded troops. Alright, so the Swedians are attacking. Oh, can I move to assist? <laughs> or I'll just go into the city and uh, do something, I suppose. Do these castle is. They lose. They lost. Is the queen around? Is she back yet, or is she? Oh my! This poor army's that cut out of position. Now what was I doing? We got to let me just get rid of it. Come in here. Because I want to go to the marketplace and assess prices. That's why I came in here. Wine, linen, wine. I don't really want to go anywhere there. I do need renown. Go see what's going on business wise here. Hello, guild master. Oh, it's right around here. Storages of salt, oil, linen, leatherwork, date, dried meat, grapes, olives, wine, ale. Let's see, what would. I'd probably get on tools. Can die. I suppose I could go buy those and profit, but let's see. Tools from iron. Looking through the numbers to see if anything is worth doing. No, it may just have to be a weavering die works. Everything else is kind of poo, except for the tools. That's not bad. Leather work. Oh, oh that. Yeah, this is a nice cheap start at least. How much is the leather work to start? Terry. Eight thousand. How much is the tool? 3500? Oh, well, that right there makes it worth it. I'm saving a lot in startup costs. I'll, uh, mark the prices. Iron to work jag. It's fine with me. good for the dual shop. Okay, well I'll leave one there, so it will be worth it. Because inventory was full, leave it there for my shop to use eventually. <laughs> 